it didn't even look that bad. But I just, I just couldn't get myself to just go. And, and then it happens. You know what happens? A different ski teacher comes up to me. A really old guy. He comes up to us and he's like, are, are you good? Are you okay? You, you're scared? And I'm like, yeah, I'm fucking scared. And, and it's like a really old dude. He told us later he's uh, 85 years old or something like that. He told us like, oh, oh, oh I'm, I'm gonna help you. It's okay. I will teach you. You can learn it immediately. No, don't worry about it. He goes skiing every day. He looks really fit. Yeah. Then he always finds someone that's like terrified and he then helps them. He's like a fucking angel, like a hero. Comes out of nowhere and then saves the, the terrified PTSD children. And I successfully um, made it all the way down with his help. Uh, it was terrifying anyway. I was I was uh, uh, yelling anyway. <laughs> I was like, ah! <laughs> scary! He had a very intense and somewhat aggressive way of teaching. Like, he was super funny. He kept on babbling, but he was like, t all the time he was yelling at me like, She pagale, 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 outfits, outfits, and he had that in crap Put the hand on to, at the body, you know, this stick front. Go and do it like this, do it like this. <laughs> so, actually, I have a video of him for you guys. <laughs> he yodeled for me. You guys want to hear him yodel? Polarelos. <laughs> Did you hear that? <laughs> At one point, he pulled out something out of his uh, jacket, like a bottle, a reused plastic bottle, where obviously uh, something else was inside before, like a, like a cocktail sauce or something like that. Um, but what was inside was like a green mix of, of something, looked like a smoothie, and I was like, what, what, what is that? And he starts drinking it like, like out of a baby bottle. And he says it's uh oh it's his it's his lunch or so or his breakfast. He doesn't cook anything. He only eats raw uh, vegetables and fruit and all that because that makes him so healthy. Like I don't know what, is if there's anything legit about what he said. But he's 85 and he's super fucking healthy and he looked like he was gonna live until he's fucking 150. I ordered some mulled wine for him and he he put like part of it in his secret bottle that he had in his jacket. For Later, he sang for us again. Do you want to see? <laughs> uh, this time, no yodeling. He sang for us a song that he uh, uh, has written himself, supposedly. <laughs> Und keiner weiß Bescheid. Bin lang schon reif für die Insel. Endlich wieder Handy frei. Ich brauch für meine Seele viel mehr Zeit. Ganz einfach was Verrücktes tun. Frag nicht wieso, weshalb, warum. Raus aus deinem Trott, deines Lebens pur. Schick dein Herz noch heut auf Entdeckungstur. Ganz einfach was Verrücktes tun, statt auf den Lorbeeren auszuruhen. Weg die Träume auf, mach es endlich wahr, sag ganz einfach ja. Ja! <lacht> oh, let's get him into uh, Holo, Holo Ian Star someday, huh? He's so sweet, but he was like talking so much. <lacht> I don't know if you guys understand this. Is this a common thing? Uh, he said his wife has a a white liver. Supposedly, it means that um she wants to um do 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 it every day. <laughs> he said he has a tough time with her because she wants to um, do it every day. <laughs> what a chad. <laughs> Ah, uh, yeah, it was, it was funny. Oh, man. 